a very, very special assembly. And we have someone who is very inspiring who is visiting us today, and his name is Todd Nicholson. I think the key message is that for me have always been uh, is to one, to never give up on your dreams. Anything is possible and to take your dreams and turn them into reality. Any sport that you can imagine, any sport that you could play, uh, that's what I did as a kid as well. And when I was 18 years old, I was on my way home from the high school prom and I was involved in a car accident and I broke my back and I didn't have the ability to use of my legs anymore. I thought to myself, what am I going to do with my life? It's really interesting how he, he, as a kid, he had a goal, but it's just that as, as the accident happened, he, had, he still had the same goal, he just changed it a bit, and he got it. I think it's very important for Paralympic athletes to come in and speak to students at school because they have a very inspiring story to tell. And I think a lot of what they communicate are things that students of all age groups can hear. Don't ever stop believing in your goals of what you're set for yourself. You just may have to find a different way to get there, and it's true. I was lucky enough to represent Canada on the international stage in hockey for over 22 years. And I played a game that for me, I didn't think I could play anymore. So when I was eight, my best friend at the time, she actually said, why don't you come try out for swimming? And I didn't really think anything of swimming. I was playing soccer and baseball and everything else, and loved them all. And I dove in the pool for the first time and absolutely loved the water. And basically from that moment on, I never stopped swimming. And when the, they blow the whistle for us to bend over to get ready to go off the block, something hits me and it goes off and I feel amazing. I think my biggest message is to never give up on yourself, ever. Because I'm living proof that you can do anything you want to do if you have the right people around you and the right motivation and the dedication and you can do anything you want. To any other schools or teachers who are interested in doing this, I think it would be a great opportunity to meet the athlete but also do these other activities in the class so that the students can um, think about athletes with disabilities and how they can um, achieve success in life even if they have a physical disability. It was really inspiring and just um, great to hear because I feel like she's just, I was talking to a legend because she was just standing right there. It was like she was one of the heroes.